Uh, I don't want to talk about politics in this video because I just had fucking four videos talking nothing about or uh, nothing else but about politics in the world. But goddamn, Arizona, how stupid do you guys have to be to agree on a fucking... What? On a fucking... 12... $12 minimum wage. twelve fifty actually. But make marijuana still... still have marijuana fucking medical only. That makes no sense to me. You would think it'd be vice versa, like, you know what? Cool. Let's fucking keep minimum wage where it is so we don't cause fucking inflation. And let's get some fucking legal weed up in this bitch. But no, no, they're like, fuck it. Let's uh, let's uh, keep weed where it is, and you know, not make any more money, even though we would make a shit ton more money. And instead, give everybody fucking a higher fucking minimum wage. Are they doing this so next year we can get fucking meta or uh, legal weed because they think people are going to be able to afford it? Well, when you're fucking go to buy a dime and it's fucking a hundred dollars more. You're like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> I'm sorry to tell you people that agreed on the fucking $12 minimum wage. And if I'm like upsetting you or whatever, I'm sorry, but you guys have to understand a $12 minimum wage doesn't mean that you're going to get a fucking $12 that, that's what you're going to be making. You're going to be making $12, yeah. But you know what? You're going to be paying the same fucking amount for shit as you were at $9. You're not going to have any extra fucking money. So let's say it went from $9 to $10. Guess what? Now everything just went up a fucking dollar. Guess what? Dollar menu at McDonald's? $5 menu. <laughs> it's not going to be a fucking dollar menu anymore. It's going to be the fucking $5 menu. And you guys are going to be fucked. Because guess what? Now everything fucking costs more. Thanks to inflation. And I mean, it's not going to take effect immediately, no. But you know what? It It is setting the groundwork to take effect. And that's what that's what's fucking sad. Like, god damn it. We shouldn't be fucking doing this shit. We should be smart and realize, you know what? Fuck it. We need medical marijuana. Give the state a whole shit ton of money through taxes, and it would have, look at Colorado, if you guys are fucking anti-pot, thanks to those fucking dumbasses from Colorado that said, oh, man, it's easier to get weed into the hands of high school students. Motherfucker, I was a high school student not too long ago. It was not hard to get weed. It would not have been hard to get weed. Fuck, you old fucks, when you were in high school, and weed was, like, a big deal, I guarantee it wasn't fucking hard to get a hold of, it was it? Everybody knew somebody that can get fucking weed. And guess what? That same guy still knows the same people to get fucking weed from. And you know what? It's not fighting the drug war. We need to stop saying... Or we, yeah, we just need to stop saying that it's fighting the drug war. It's not fucking fighting the drug war. I'm sorry to tell you guys. The war on drugs is never going to fucking end. It's just something to scare people with. If we think that making weed legal is going to stop the fucking Mexican drug cartels, it doesn't work that way. You know what? We take away pot from them, guess what? Now they don't have to worry about selling pot. Now they can sell meth and fucking cocaine, heroin, all that shit. The, the real fucking bad drugs. That's what you guys should be focusing on. You know what? I, I think you guys all need to go watch the fucking Adam Ruins Everything Drugs. Because he explains a ton of shit. God damn, it's beautiful. I'm sorry. He explains a ton of shit. And it just like, it, it makes you think like, God damn. The U.S. is stupid. <laughs> I live here. I love the U.S. I love my country. I shouldn't say the U.S. is stupid. I should say our government and the fucking people leading it are fucking retarded. Now, I know we're getting a new president in January, guess what, new president, but that's not going to change the fact he's, that our fucking government's still a bunch of stupid assholes. They're always going to be a bunch of stupid assholes. That's how it works. God damn, it's fucking beautiful. 
check this shit out. In March, uh, for the meetup, if any of you guys want to come this way with me, I'll take you guys this way. Just uh, let me know. Come find me and say that you guys want to go this way. If we get enough people, we'll split off and we'll go head out this way and just enjoy. You're not going to be hauling ass. You're not going to be doing anything stupid. Just let me know and I'll take us all out here. This is fucking beautiful, man. I'm going to link this footage to fucking Timage and his wife and just be like, yo, guys, check this shit out. It's not paved, but you know what? If people are willing to go check it out, you guys don't have to be hauling ass or be on dirt bikes for this road. I know, actually, I, now that I see it and I know where I am, I know quite a few people that have taken this road on fucking cruisers, so... pull off right here and take a piss because it's fucking beautiful oh, that's a thing now god damn it's beautiful up here <laughs> my turn signal has been on this whole fucking time oh I gotta piss no, I'm not letting you guys fucking look at my dick. Quick, easy piss. God damn, it's beautiful. I need to take a picture of the bike. I'm sorry, I guess I need to take a picture of Mary Jane. Honestly, I don't need it on right now either. I can just leave it off. I should fucking turn it off, but I'm not. <laughs> Holy shit, when that happened? Oh, fuck, it broke. That's what fucking broke. My turn signal's fucking screwed. I'm gonna have to fix that when I get home. I don't even know how that fucking broke. <laughs> At least my fronts are still good. And the fucking burnt one is still doing great. <laughs> Who would have fucking thought, right? This is where electric start would come in fucking real handy.